Sure. How's it going, DeAndre? Thanks for doing this. Uh, with, with all the reps that you seem to be getting, how comfortable have you been with the work that they've been uh, allowing you to get throughout the course of this, uh, this training camp? Yeah, um, I would just say my biggest thing is making sure that I gain trust of everyone from the defense and the coaching staff, just making sure the guys that I'm there next to trust me and can vibe with me. Just to follow up on that, if I could, given that you guys have such a young outside linebacker group, who do you kind of lean on for, for advice, for uh, information while you're out there on the field? How does that dynamic kind of work? Uh, I would say I would lean on uh, Harold Landry, Kamale, and now that Vic is in the room, Vic has some good insight on different things he can help with as well. But as far as plays and if I'm having trouble, I would go try to sit down with Harold and make sure that I'm understanding it or whatnot. Hey, DeAndre, can you move just a hair closer so we can hear you a little better? That's good. Uh, John Glennon? Yeah. Uh, hey, DeAndre. Uh, wondering what your thoughts were on uh, Big Isaiah back in college, and and now that he's here, um, are you seeing a different person now? Any anything uh, changes as he's trying to go to the next level? Yeah, um, I feel like Isaiah is a great player, and he's a great player. All right. All right. Fair enough. Uh, um, wondering. Uh, uh, if you could talk a little bit about yourself as well and as you're uh, getting better, are you, you feel like you're stronger right now against the, the run or the, or the pass and, and maybe what you're trying to work on? Uh, like I said, my biggest thing is making sure that I gain trust from all the, all the guys that's on the defense and that I'll be playing next to and making sure that the coaches trust me. And that's the biggest thing, just making sure everybody can trust me in, in the game and understanding what I do and trying to get better each and every day and, just trying to find something every day to improve on mainly and trust. Making sure that everybody on the field can trust me. A try. A part of that I would imagine is trusting yourself. So going from last year to this year, what would you say is the biggest difference? Like is there a better comfort level or what what would be behind you having that full trust in yourself to be able to prove yourself to everyone else? Just trying, like I said, just trying to get better each and every snap and understanding whatever the play call might be and understanding what I'm doing and what everybody else is doing. And if I have to make a call, make sure I make it loud enough to the point where everybody can hear me. And just, I feel like I I, I get, I, I find trust in myself by going out and doing it and practicing and learning from my mistakes. If I did make a mistake or coming back in and the coach is coaching me up and just asking questions and trying to be involved and making sure that I communicate with everybody and that everybody understands that I know what's going on and that I can relay it back to everybody. Uh, Jim? Yeah, Andre, what, what's it like just, I guess, just being back out there? I know last year had been tough for you, know, what, you know, kind of rehab and your teammates were practicing. Just, just the fact you're out there practicing, how, how good has that felt the last, you know, couple of weeks? I mean, it feels amazing, but at the same time, I haven't did it in a minute. So it's just honing into the small details and making sure that I'm rolling off of my foot and not uh, false stepping and striking with my hands every play, making sure that they're not weak or I'm not bench pressing or whatnot. Just just honing in on the little details and fundamentals. Uh, Terry? DeAndre, because – your season was cut so short so early last year. Are there things that you still feel like you're a rookie, and then are there some things where you feel like you've you've got it down? Man, every day I feel like a rookie. But I mean, at the same time, it's it's still I, I, it's good that I, we get a chance to go out there and practice, and you can learn from your mistakes if you if I like, if you do make any or whatnot, and just try not to do the same mistake twice. But yeah, man, it's. I still feel like a rookie, yes. Uh, Paul Kaharski? What What was your kind of pattern last year, DeAndre? What uh, I'm not even sure if you stuck around, but but what were you doing to try to keep up and, and learn without being on the field? Yeah, um, just coming in and, and sitting in on some of the meetings if I was able to or – 
any chance I would get meeting with the coaches or talking to the players about play calls or whatnot. And I would work out. I would come and work out and whatnot. So. I know you've been primarily on the, the left side going against right tackles now. Are they asking you to hone in on that at this time? Um, I, I really didn't never even pay that any attention. But um, I don't think that really matters. It's just It just happens that way if that's what you guys see. Uh, David Beauclair. DeAndre, as, as long as it's been since you've played a football game, how disappointed were you in the preseason getting canceled and, and how excitedly are you counting down to the regular season here? Um, I'm just glad that we get a chance to practice and I feel like everybody is in, adjusting well to the new circumstances and not having preseason. So I just have to fall in line and adjust and make sure I take every advantage of every practice that we do get an opportunity to go out there and practice, when we do get an opportunity to go out there and practice. Uh, Teresa? DeAndre, how tough was it, though? You, you come into the NFL, you're with the Titans, and, and injuries just kind of short-circuited that first season. Uh, was it something that you had to make sure you deal with the, the mental side and the emotional side uh, so that until you could get to the point of getting back to football? Uh, yes, I would say just understanding my worth and, and not losing confidence in myself and just trying to grind each and every day and find something every single day to get better at or, like I said, try to stay as much involved as I can.